today I'm just going to show you how to run those really old games that you may have ran in Windows 95, Windows 98, and even Windows XP on a Windows Vista 7 or 8 machine. Um, I have here Hugo's House of Horrors 2, and if I, it's an old DOS game. If I go to click on it, unfortunately you get an error. Um, one thing you can try with these old games is you can right-click the EXE and go to Properties and then go to Compatibility. And then you can hit run this program as Windows 98, Windows Me, Windows 2000, whatever the case may be for the game, and then also check run this program as an administrator. Hit Apply, hit OK, and then try to run it again. And when we run into this, this is the problem with the 32-bit and the 64-bit architecture that it's just not cross-compatible. So what we can do from there is we can download a program called DOSBox, which can be found right here at DOSBox.com. Go to the download section and whatever, whatever operating system you're running, download it for your operating system and install it. Once it's installed, you're going to want to make a shortcut to your desktop and wherever the EXE or a game is, you can just click and drag it in and install it like you normally would. Okay, it should be installed, and now we can actually run the game. Go back in the DOS box, drag it, and there you have it. If you're looking for old DOS games, you can go to dosgames.com. They have a lot of nice DOS games there. Um, you can also go to my site, geekandfreak.com. I do have what's called the DOS Games Project. It is a very large, rare file. And you can see the list of games right there on the site and see what you're looking for. That's it.